Hello everyone, Andrea here, there's the music, and welcome to a game that I found on Itch.io called Planet Dysphoria and the Escape Attempt. What this game is about is basically, as it says, dysphoria. And what dysphoria is, is, uh, the best way I can describe it is the gender that you're physically born as. It doesn't match the gender that you feel you are and that you identify as, so it can it causes these like it can trigger depression, anxiety, feeling out of place, like you're just not in the right body, just a lot of not good things, basically. That's probably not the best explanation of it, but honestly you can Google it if you want to learn more about it, what it is and the effects it has on people and stuff like that. And it's a big reason why a lot of people transition, because they can't, like, they know they're supposed to be the other gender, so they become what they're supposed to be, so yeah. It's, I'm not the best at explaining this stuff, at least not verbally. Typing I can do better at, usually, but yeah, whatever. But anyways, I decided to play this game because I have quite a few friends, actually, who are trans. And some of them are affected very badly by their dysphoria at times. And I hate seeing them have to go through it. And what this game is, is, is it's supposed to be like a physical manifestation of dysphoria. And what it's like trying to live with it. I, uh, let, let's get into the game and I'll show you guys. In your dreams at night, you fall. The mornings are not much better. You've been living here on planet Dysphoria for the past three years. It's not too different from where you grew up, but it lacks a certain earthiness. The leaves are thinner here. They sway less in the wind. The dome above you is a supermarket brand sky with budget clouds, a watered down sun, a wind that hums instead of whistling. It's like that writer said, living on the... I'm sorry, I have the game made the window really tiny so it's hard for me to read this. Maybe you guys can. Uh, however you have a plan. Your neighbor, the large and grouchy rocket scientist, has been bringing his work home with him. Which is to say that he is building something in his backyard. Something big. Hopefully, your ticket off this planet. Oh. Oh, hello! This is a very... Uh, is something wrong with my roof? Well, that's interesting. Oh, it's my bed. I, I, can I have naps? No, no nap. It's outside. Oh, objectives. Take hormones. Okay. I guess that's my neighbor over there, probably. There's the hormones. Can I explore? No? I need to take my hormones first. Okay. Boop! Bitter. The taste and also the reason for taking them. Over there we have a counter for them, I can see. Ooh, pretty. Pretty flowers. Hello, neighbor! How are you today, good sir? Um, nothing under the stairs. Sinks. Can't do anything here. Ooh, breakfast. Foods. Did I just walk on that chair? I did. Well. I mean, it's my house, I guess. Noms? I went noms. Nom nom nom. Num num num. Very good. Good breakfast. Your body tingles and feels separate from the rest of the world. Like a broken iPod, you and it are out of sync. Wow. Interesting tree. Wait. Door? I came out of door here. Well, that's interesting. It's weird. It's built very weirdly. Are there any- no, there's no one else around, just- just us here. Okay. Oh, 
Hello, boulder. Look at that boulder. That's a nice boulder. I'm gonna call you Shrek. Okay, let's go. You know, the trees look a lot like boulders in a way, too, just lumpier, because for some reason the boulders aren't as lumpy. But that's very lumpy and bouldery like. Tree boulders. Whoa, weird noises. Hello. Is this it? Clicky click? No? Ooh, here's a window. That's creeping. It, it's be a creep. Hello. Oh, try the door. But I wanna I wanna explore. I wanna go look at things. More tree boulders. A normal pine tree. Ooh, what's this? Um, sir? Neighbor? Excuse me, dude, but, uh, are you aware that, well, for one, your roof isn't quite right, but also that there is a mysterious trapdoor right here in your backyard? Is that normal, sir? I'm supposed to try the door. So. Boop. The door is locked. Crap. My neighbor is not an idiot. He didn't keep the door- he didn't leave the door unlocked. He did keep it locked. I don't know what I'm saying. Tree boulders. Pretty flowers. <sighs> Hello? Click. Sorry, neighbors. Yeah, sorry, I'm just casually taking your shit. You can't watch TV anymore, but hey, at least now I- Actually, I did you guys a favor. I want drinks. No? Okay. Now, you don't have to worry about watching Teen Titans Go! You're welcome! Can I snoop around up here? What's in the closet? Am I in the closet? No, apparently not. Okay. No one's going to sleep with you. Uh... Okay? Boop! Hardcore parkour. Yeah. Do Oh, my hormones are getting low. Should I go take- I mean, I think I'm okay for now. Use the antenna to lock the- unlock. You're running out of hormones. Return to your bedroom. Find the bottle and consume. I knew it. Okay, but can't I- Yeah! This is the scientist world. Okay, I'll be back. Hopefully it doesn't relock that door because my neighbor doesn't have any more TV antennas for me to steal. Running. We're coming back here. We're running back up the stairs. Here we go. Woo! Oh god. Oh god, I broke everything. I'm running eternally. Oh god. I think I fixed it. Okay, thank god. Boop. Uh, boop. Are hormones the answer, or just another question? What happens if I take more? My doctor says my hormones are spiking my potassium levels. My heart could stop. Damn. I wish I could be all like the other queer people. The ones with perfect transitions. Am I just fork enough to call myself different? Will I ever be part of a club? Okay, we're back to the first thing. Well, shit. That's, uh... Why is my mouse out of the game? Oh my god. Uh, sorry. My ma I- so something happened with my mouse and I'm not quite sure what. Um, anyways, let's come back over here and finish our exploring. Cause we've got to search this place. If I could get through the door, that'd be great. The heck is this? You don't know what this box is, but it is ice cold to the touch. Is it a fridge? Is it a fridge? This is either some weird beaker thingy, or a coffee pot. I hope it's a coffee. This is for making coffee at a specific temperature. Hell yeah! The scientist knows what's up. What is this? Rocket? It makes sense. These are the plans for an interstellar transportation rocket. This is what he's been built. Is this what he's been building? There must be some kind of hidden hatch nearby. Ah, I know where that is. My coffee's done. I want. Gimme, give, give. Give. 
give? Aww. Give. No give. No coffee. The heck? Boop. Oh god. Did it again. Boop. 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 But this... So I have nothing to say about this? What's this? This looks like stolen equipment. It says property of Acme Corp. Acme Corp. Ah, yes. Ooh, now can I clicky click? This is a map of recent weather patterns for the area. Interesting. Can I click this? I cannot. Oh. Well. Let's go hatch exploring. Do do boop boop. God. So square, so pressable. Ah, oh, it says to press the button, but do I really want to press the button? What's gonna happen if I press the button? Is there a box shaped here? There is. That's suspicious. I'm gonna do. It. I'm gonna boop it. Boop. Oh God. Oh, okay. Goodbye, ground. It has a tree up. There goes the tree boulder. What the hell is that? A portal. Sure to fizz my atoms into pieces. Objective. Enter the rocket portal. That's supposed to fizz my atoms to pieces. That's a big rocket down there. Look at that. Can I say anything about this rocket? I cannot. Okay. It's a peanut boulder. Shaped like a giant peanut. Well, not from this side, but... Yeah. I'm losing my mind. I thought of some... Wub, wub, wub. You're running out of hormones. Return to your bedroom. No! No! Uh, let's go into the wub, wub. Oh god, that got mad. Your stolen rocket accelerates. The soft flesh around your face shifts against your skull as, gra as gravi gravitational forces take hold. The skin, fat, and muscle it, it is shifting into a shape that better represents your inner self. You will be back here again, but for now, enjoy the ride. Planet Dysphoria. Oh shit. I know I was like joking around saying a lot of stupid stuff during this game, but I like this a lot. I mean, dysphoria isn't something that I personally really go through. But so like I can't say that this is like an amazing representation of what it is or not because it's not something I personally experience so what do you guys think and also for any of you if you watch this and this is something that you go through how about we all make comments down below on how we cope on how you guys all cope with it and different tips that way, anyone else who comes across this, if they're having these struggles, maybe they'll find something there to help them, too. Let's all help each other. Because this is something that no one should have to go through, let alone go through alone. So, let's try to help out. Okay? And... I don't think there is anything more that could be done in the game. But if it's something that you'd like to try your, for yourself, just to play, because it is a nice little game, I'll make sure to leave a link for it down in the description, which it is, it's a name your own price. You can download it for free, or you can pay like $2 or so, something like that for it. So that's kind of up to you guys. If you want to pay for it, I go ahead. If you don't, don't, it's really up to you guys but for any of you that are dealing with dysphoria 
please, don't give up because things will get better. I know it's hard as hell. I've seen, like, quite a few of my friends struggling with it themselves. But you will be happy with yourself one of these days. You just have to make it there. And it'll be worth it. And know that you're never alone. There's always going to be others that are... They know what it's like. They've gone through it. They're currently going through it. Find them. Ask them for help. Because there's nothing wrong with that. But I'm going to end this video here. Because I'm not sure what else to say exactly. So thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, let me know down below with a like or a comment. If there's any other games like this that you would like to see me play, definitely tell me, and I'll check them out. And I hope you're all having a good day or night, wherever you are, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!